Hey guys, it's Janice Skelton and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing um, a label story and yeah, so can I meet my daughter first? This is Zendaya. Say hi baby. <laughs> She's kind of angry. <laughs> okay, so um, what happened was, um, so it was my last dent um, clinic appointment, like my weekly checkups. And I was, it was in Penrith, I went to it. It was my last one before I was like my due date. And I went with um, my boyfriend's mum, Mel, and she drove me there. And when we were there, they were like, you know, doing the usuals. They were checking my blood pressure, they were measuring my stomach, checking baby's heart rate. And um, what's it called? So yeah, so my blood pressure was very high and it's very dangerous while you're pregnant. So they told me to go straight to the hospital. So on I went to the hospital, and yeah, so I was there for like four hours and they were like doing like freaking needles and checking my blood pressure and I hate needles so much. So yeah, they kept doing like sticking needles in my freaking leg and, <laughs> and yeah, so everything was normal after four hours we got sent home. Oh wait, I forgot to say, when I was at my clinic appointment they done this stretch and sweep on me which brings on labour and they said that if I didn't give birth by that week then they're going to have to induce me. So anyways, uh, I've never felt Braxton Hicks ever before. So when I was on the way home from the hospital, I was feeling like contractions. I wasn't sure if they were contractions or what they were because I've never felt them before. They were like, oh, they were just so painful. It was like my stomach, like from my lower back to the front of my stomach, it was like tightening. And like from the top of it, it was just like tightening so much. Like every four minutes it was happening. And they said that you're, when you're in labor, it happens every two to like every two minutes or something and that means you're in labor so on the way home I was in the car I was sitting in the car I wasn't like I didn't say anything because I wasn't sure if it was like contractions or what so I didn't want to say anything so I thought I was over exaggerating but they were just happening I was looking at the time I kept timing it so I told Mel I like I'm feeling pain but I don't know if they're like contractions or what then she's like oh like how does it feel and I'm like well it's like from my lower back to like it comes straight to the front and it was just like hardening I don't know how to explain it but yeah so anyways um <laughs> so what else happened um so yeah so we're at home we're like we're just timing my contractions we're, we ate dinner we're making time pass this was our, and after when we were timing it, it was happening every like three minutes and when it was happening every three minutes and that's when we decided to go to the hospital and it was like about 9 30 at night we went to the hospital we got to the hospital around like um, like 10 ish, and after they said when I got there, they um, they checked if how much, if I was dilated or not, and I was about three centimeters dilated, and yeah, and after that, um, I was just remember sitting on the hospital bed, laying them. I was having contractions every 30 minutes, and they were just getting stronger and stronger. They're like <sighs> tightening pain, you know, like <sighs> like that. Then after I had to just. Breathe in and breathe out. I was just like legit sitting on my hospital bed like this. I was like, I just remember closing my eyes and like breathing in and breathing out, which helped like thin the pain, like help. Ugh, I don't even know how to talk. Like help with the pain, and yeah. So, um, it was around, <coughs> it was around three o'clock. It was yeah, it was three o'clock. They came in. It was three a.m. in the morning actually, and they came in and they checked it to see how much centimeters I was dilated. I was six centimeters dilated. So what happened was I was like, the pain went from like zero to 100 real quick. It was like, boom, like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, it felt like her head was like coming out of my ass, like my bum. <laughs> it was like, her head was like coming out of my bum. And um, it's like I needed shit. I'm, it's like I needed shit. I was like, so before that I was like, like, I was kind of screaming, but I wasn't. So, anyways, the um, midwife told me to go have a shower. I'm like, I don't want a shower. She's like, have a shower to help with, like, the heat will help with the pain. So, I, anyways, I went in the shower. I was naked. I was, like, on my fours. And after um, Isaac, he was, like, putting the hot water on my back. Then after that, I was just, like, screaming hot water on my back. Then after that, I was just, like, screaming. I was like, ah! I was full screaming my head off. I was like, I could feel her head. Take her out. I was like just scream my head off because like the pain it was like I did chuck a shit it was like not chuck a shit but like obviously like it felt like that her head was just like <laughs> 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 
okay, baby. Felt like that. Her head was just like, oh, it's okay, baby. Her head, what's wrong? What's wrong? Her head was like coming down on like. Come. Okay, she's gonna cry for this soon. Can you please get her dummy? Okay. Um. So her head was like pushing toward like down like head was legit on my freaking uh the down there I'll just <laughs> think of the pen hurts. <laughs> think of the pen hurts. So anyways, I was sitting I was like to Isaac, I was like on my fours like this, like my leg and my freaking knees and my like arms. I was like on the floor like that and the water was just running on my back. I was like looking I just remember looking up at Isaac I was like, I need a shit, I need a shit, I need a shit like that. <laughs> so anyways, um he was laughing at me. He's like, oh, you got this. I'm like, I can't do this. I can't do it. And he's like, you could do this. You've came this far. You could do this. Then anyways, um, I sat on the toilet and I was trying to chuck a shit. I was like, pushing. I was like, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was like, trying to chuck a shit. But like, it was her head. Then anyways, the nurse told me, I mean, the midwife told me, it's okay. The nurse told me, I mean, ugh, the midwife told me to go on the bed. So I was on the bed and I was laying on the bed and I was screaming my head off. My legs were like up in like the air like that. <laughs> my legs were like up in the air like that. And after, um, yeah. So I was like, yeah. I was screaming. I was like, <gasps> they're like, breathe in, breathe out. I couldn't breathe in, breathe out, but I'd done it once. I was like, fuck this. Yes. I was like, <sighs> they're like, ah. I was like full screaming, I was just screaming my head off. Then I thought, like legit within two minutes, she came out. Like she just flopped out like that. <laughs> it just felt like release, like a release, you know? A relief, oh, release even, relief. Like her head came out first, like whoop. Then her whole body swiggled. <laughs> and after, I just remember my legs, oh, so I didn't take, you know, I didn't have any epidural or nothing. But yeah, so she just flopped out and it felt so good, like, after that, then after that, I had to get stitches. I just remember, oh yeah, I had the gas while I was having my stitches. Yeah. I remember the like gas mask. So I was like, <laughs> after I was laughing, I was like, I just remember Isaac being there, then baby being like on my stomach like this. And I was just like, <sighs> it was like I was hallucinating or whatever. It's like I was like, because like it's like this gas, right? And, like you put it on this, so like it could, so you can't feel the pain, but you can still feel the pain. Anyways, I felt the pain, like I could feel the stitches like going. Like that, like the string thingy, like I could feel it fully on. And then yeah, so that's my labor vlog. But yeah, I was in hospital for only one night and after we got to go home. And this little baby was a fatty. Yes, she's a little fatty. Look how much hair she has. <laughs> Her hair stayed down for once, it's always up. She really brushed it down, but yeah, it's finally down. So what else? Am I missing anything? Um, so she was, um, 3.4 kilos. Wait, am I wrong? <laughs> yeah, she was 3.4. Yeah, she was 3.4 kilos. She was 51 centimeters. And she was born at 3.18 a.m. So, um, yeah, my labor went pretty quick, to be honest. Like, considering, like, my friend, her labor went for, like, 26 hours. But everyone's different. Like, everyone's... It de like everyone's body's different, you know. Everyone's labor's different, but yeah, we I had a good labor, better than I expected to be honest. And yeah. Um. So thank you guys for watching my YouTube channel. I mean YouTube video. Please like, subscribe, and comment below. Bye. <laughs> Say bye, baby. Bye. Say bye. Hmm, she's angry. Say bye bye. Say bye, baby. <laughs>